That I'm not your princess This ain't a fairy tale I'm not the one you sweep off your feet Lead her up the stairwell What's up everyone? I'm Ashleen and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a beginner's guitar tutorial on how to play the acoustic version of White Horse by Taylor Swift. So White Horse is from Taylor Swift's Fearless album and it's a track number five song. And if you're a Swifty, you know exactly what track number five songs mean. So if you want to learn how to play the acoustic version and learn the picking pattern of how to play White Horse by Taylor Swift, then keep on watching. All right, so if you're a beginner, I do use a picking pattern um, for this song. It is quite simple, but if you're just learning how to play the guitar, then you can also use um, a strumming pattern with the same chords, and you can just make it your own, and it can be quite simple. So I'm gonna zoom you in here and show you the chords. So for all the beginners out there, I'm just gonna show you the numbering of the strings if you are wanting to do the picking pattern for this song. So this is string number six, five, four, three, two, and one. And the chords you're going to need to know for this song are quite simple. So first is going to be a C. Next is an A minor. So next is a modified F, so if you're unable to do the bar chord if you're a beginner or just learning guitar, then I would recommend this, and this is actually the chord I use specifically um, in this acoustic cover. So this is F. And then the last one is a G. So those are the chords you're going to need to know for this song. So let me zoom in again here and show you the picking pattern for each chord. So starting off with C, I'm going to be picking with my thumb the fifth string and the second string at the, at the same time. So just like this. And then I'm going to hit the guitar or chuck. And then I'm going to pick the fifth string and the first string together. So I'll put that together again for C. So fifth string and second string at the same time. Chuck or hit. And then fifth string and fifth string at the same time. And then after I do the fifth string and the first string at the same time, I'm going to chuck again. So putting it together again a little faster. Fifth string and second string pluck at the same time. And then chuck and then fifth string and the first string at the same time, pick, and then chuck. And then I'm gonna move to A minor. So I'm gonna pick the fifth string, again, same thing, fifth string and the second string at the same time, and then chuck, and then fifth string and the first string at the same time, pick, and then chuck. So again, fifth string and second string at the same time, and then fifth string and first string at the same time. And then I'm gonna move to F, or the modified F. So I'm gonna pick, I'm gonna move down one string here to the fourth string and second string. So I'm gonna pick them at the same time. Pick, then chuck, or hit. And then I'm going to pick the fourth string and the first string at the same time. And then chuck again. So again, the fourth string and the second string at the same time for F. And then chuck, and then the fourth string and the first string at the same time. Chuck. And then moving to G, I'm going to pick the sixth string and the second string at the same time. Chuck. And then the sixth string and the first string at the same time. Pick. And then chuck. So this is how the picking pattern and chord progression is going to go for the first half of all of the verses. Alright guys, 
so that's the picking pattern kind of slowed down if you do want to pause the video and watch that again to get a hang of the picking pattern then please feel free to do so so there is a change in how the chords progress from the first half of the verse to the second half of the verse so let me zoom you in and show you here. So I'll just go through the first verse here and show you the difference in the chord progression. So we're going to start off with C here. So I'll try to go slow here. Say you sorry that face of an angel comes out just when you need it to. As I pace back and forth all this time cause I honestly believe And then this is where the change happens. So you go to A minor. Holding on the day's track on stupid girl. I should have known. I should have known. So from holding on, it goes from A minor. So pick, chuck, pick, chuck. And then the modified F. Pick, chuck, pick, chuck. And then I go to G and I pick it three times actually. So I go. Pick, chuck, pick, chuck, pick. And then it goes into the chorus. And then when you get to the chorus, it's the same chord progression as the start of the song. So it goes C, A minor, modified F, and then G. So I'm not your princess. This ain't a fairy tale. I'm not the one you sweep off her feet. Lead her out the stairwell. This ain't Hollywood. This is a small town I was a dreamer for you and you let me down And then at this part is when it changes a bit again So the part where she goes it's too late for you and your white horse to come around What I do is I pick once A minor so I pick the fifth string and the second string and then I just once and then I pick G the sixth string and second string once and then I pick the modified F the fourth string and second string once and then I go back to G and pick the sixth string and the first string once so putting that all together slowly So again, it goes A minor, G, F, and then G. So with the lyrics, it goes, And it's too late for you and your white horse to come around. And then you would start on the C again. Alright guys, so that's my beginner's guitar tutorial on how to play the acoustic version of White Horse by Taylor Swift. 
Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like this, then click that subscribe button. And I would love to know what you thought of this guitar tutorial, so let me know in the comments below. And if you have any more suggestions for beginner guitar tutorials, then also let me know in the comments below. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care. Bye.